Hey, let me show you how to optimize battery settings of your Redmi Note 13 Pro Plus. Let's get started. So if your battery drains quickly, then following settings may help you a lot. First thing we can do is open settings and then go in the battery tab. And right here you can switch to battery saver for extra time. And you can also switch to ultra battery saver and this mode restricts most power consuming features and leave just basics such as calls, SMS and connecting to network. You can also go in additional features and right here enable speed up charging and boost charging speed to make your phone charging quicker. Now let's return to the previous page and go in the battery checkup. And right here you can manage which apps can run in the background and enable some options to reduce battery consumption. And then click this add button. What else we can do to improve your battery life is to disable some of the not needed functions as advertising for example. For this let's just go back in the settings then choose privacy tab and right here you would need to choose ads. So let's scroll, then click Ads and go in Add Privacy. And make sure that App Suggested Ads, Ad Topics and App Measurements are disabled because they drain a lot of battery. Let me move back to the settings, but now we would need to choose additional settings. So let's tap it and right here, select Accounts and Synchronizing from the list of other options and then choose your Google account. And now turn off automatic synchronization for apps you don't need all the time, like a calendar for example, and drive. And just go back to save the changes. Now let's disable location permission for several apps because it drains your battery a lot. So let's go back to the settings as before, but now choose location tab. And right here go in application permission and just Disable permission for all the time to don't allow for not necessary apps such as Amazon Shopping, for example. And now to save your battery life, we can also go in sound and vibration tab right here and just adjust the haptic feedback level, reduce its intensity so it won't drain your battery as quickly as before. And the last one, let's talk about display. So. Let's go in the play in brightness and right here enable auto brightness by clicking on this switcher so the screen automatically adjusts to the lightning and saves the battery. And also you can enable dark mode so it will save your battery especially if you have an AMOLED screen. And now just scroll a little bit more to see the refresh rate option. Let's click it. Then switch to custom if you had default previously and choose 60 Hz. So you can choose it if your battery is almost dead because this will reduce the power consumption. And that's all. Now you know all about the battery and I hope this video was useful for you. Thank you so much for watching.